Hello, I'm Kyle from the Technology Learning Center here at the Cape May Courthouse Library, and I'll be showing you several crafts tied to our current theme of rainbows, all of which you can try at home yourself. For our first craft, go ahead and gather an assortment of colored markers, making sure they are the washable kind, and a paper towel or napkin. With these, we're going to color a tiny rainbow on one of the edges of the napkin, creating about an inch long stripe for each color. Once finished, we are grabbing a glass and filling it with water, then dropping our rainbow into the glass, letting the edge of the napkin or paper towel sit just barely above the surface of the water. What you will see next is because of something called capillary action, which is a liquid, like our water here, ability to travel through narrow spaces against gravity, just like how trees suck up water from the ground. As our towel sucks up the water, it runs through our rainbow and picks up the color from our washable markers, bringing the rainbow all the way up our napkin. For our next craft, we are continuing to make use of capillary action to create rainbow bridges. Here you will need several glasses along with an assortment of liquid food dye as we will be dyeing the water we are pouring into these glasses to create a rainbow of colors our bridges will be running between. Same as before, we are sticking either paper towels or napkins into the water and then connecting the other end of the napkin into the next jar over. As we do this, the water from the jar gets sucked up into our bridges and the different colors start to meet in the center creating our bridges into a colorful display. For our last craft, you will need a plate that can hold water and as many colorful skittles as possible. With our plate, we are placing the skittles all along the edge using any pattern you see fit. Once they are all set up, we are then pouring the warm water on the center of the plate, making sure we pour enough water that our skittles get mostly submerged. As the warm water reacts with the dye on the outer coating of the skittles, it begins to run off into the water creating an amazing pattern that soon takes up the whole plate. If you enjoyed these crafts and would like to see more, follow the Technology Learning Center on our social media to find more cool crafts that you can do at home. Enjoy your craft!